This is episode 6 of playing ranked game until I reach challenger. First game I got top lane, I banned this bitch as usual. Enemy first picks Isuo and then Vayne and they also pick Corky. So at this point I thought maybe the Vayne was top lane. So I decided to pick Teemo. And oh boy I was wrong. Then the game begins. And now I just want you to watch. Watch what will happen. And to my surprise, I actually got the first blood. And in this moment, I'm gonna teach you how to play Teemo. When you play Teemo against Azizuo, bait out his um, wind wall. If you can bait it out, you can pretty much win the fight completely. And in another moment, I'm pretty much just dominating this Yasuo because I'm completely better. I pretty much counter him with my first kill. He just keeps running away. He can't beat me. Like there's no way. After that, I go to my teammates to help them from the dragon because it, it's my job, no? Say top laner, it's your job to help your teammates. If you can't split push, you need to help your teammates in team fights. I know most Teemo players, or I don't know actually, but like one of the most common like how to say it, complaint by other players are Teemos are very like like playing um, how do you say it like they only play for themselves but as a Teemo main you should actually help your teammates like this I then continued shitting all over the place because it's my job as a Teemo. But then a fight happens in mid lane. And like I said, help your teammates, kill some fucking bitches, and you get the money. I definitely had the ability to kill Yasuo here, but I'm just a nice person. I'm just a nice person. What can I say, man? I'm so nice. In this moment, I will prove to you why I think Teemo is like a team player. Like watch, watch I'm gonna do. After that, we continued fighting the enemy team and we were winning. And after this team fight, we were able to get the dragon, I mean Baron. And yeah, we pretty much win the game, completely. And yeah, for our first game, I didn't expect playing Teemo this game, and yeah, it was actually pretty good. Like, it was actually fucking fun. Second game, I got top lane again. Our support wanted to play this, so I banned this Kakpoch instead. But she was still banned by the enemy team. Enemy first picks Sion, then our mid lane picks Yasuo. So I had to play Cannon. And actually, this game, I actually didn't do much. I got carried, but I will show you the things that I did, like a little bit. Enjoy. And 
yeah that was pretty much it for the second game in my third game i got outsider we are in my team and as usual i tried to annoy him oh and yeah i played dragus this game outsider was playing zed and i was hoping he would like make a montage like get 10 kills or over 10 kills and actually be in his youtube video and I plan to like plug my channel in this comment section. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I'm kidding, but I'm gonna comment in the video if he actually uploads one. But anyways, the game continues. In this moment, I fucked up a bit. Like it's a bad way to start. Like outsider is watching and then I fuck up like this. But he also fucks up, so it's actually all good. In this moment, I almost killed Wukong, but I don't want to make the same mistake as I did earlier. Luckily after, Outsider then ganks me, so we're able to kill this guy. Bro, I'm finally on YouTube. Like bro, I'm actually on YouTube, like check his channel. Like bro, I'm actually there now. What the fuck? In another moment, I fucked up my skill set, but luckily, Outsider here. I mean, just watch. Outsider, man. Look at him. Look at the man go, man. He's the goat for real. Like bro, watch him. Look at him, bro. But anyways, I continued to chase this Wukong, but apparently, Wuk I mean, Lee Sin, our Lee Sin was like, focus on the enemy team's blue buff. So, yeah, this was this what happens, but we still get, I'm fumbling, but I still, ah, oh, fuck, we were able to get the skill. I'm not gonna retake this fucking voiceover, this part. I'm sorry guys, I'm so sorry. In another moment, I fight this Wukong again, but, you know. I know Outsider had my back, so... Hey bro, it's skill issue, man. That's just skill issue. After that, there was nothing much that happened, and yeah, we're pretty much able to win this game. Oh and yeah, he actually gave me a like, but I forgot to like my teammate after this game. My bad. In my last game of the day, I got top lane again. Our team was actually able to pick Swain, so that was good. I picked Aurelia because I can actually play 80 top lane now. Because our mid was Swain, he was AP. And yeah, I was against a Lucian, range top. Like bro, if you're gonna be a loser, you know? No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But yeah, I was playing against this guy. I'm gonna stop the voiceover fast one. This is the last game as usual, as the ritual or whatever. I'm just gonna talk through this game. But yeah, it's gonna be talking about random shit or whatever. But in this moment, I was destroying this um this solution top. Like I was like really better. Like watch me go. Like holy shit. And yeah, I had to help help out my teammates. I said, watch this shit. Bam. Bam, nice shot from Jin. I, okay, but yeah. Being at me here in top lane, like, bro, I'm the fucking ghost. Like, look at this shit, watch it, watch it. And I was able to live, bro. I'm actually the ghost, what the heck? Okay. Why am I acting like this now? I'm sorry. But yeah, look at this. We were actually winning this game. Like, by huge margins. We were winning, but. Well, it's not this moment thing, but what? We're winning, we're actually in the lead. Like, we're able to get the power, and hit power, like in this next moment. But first, watch this satisfying minion here. But yeah, in this another moment, like, this reason. At this point, I thought we were actually winning the game, so I was like DMing, DMing this fucking team like bro watch this shit i'm bullying this guy like ignite kill dang <laughs> but yeah after this moment like okay to my defense i thought like our swain and nami would win this fight against the what's the name of this champion but yeah this girl champion but, uh kaisa but yeah they fucking lost after this they were able to get the baron so like that was pretty much fucked 
Like we had some glimmer of hope like this moment. Like, I was able to kill this carry Kaisa, their MVP. But our Jin was AFK. So we pretty much lost this game. Like there was no way of winning this. Like this is my last try to win this game, but like, bro, there's only so much you can do. And yeah. And I feel like this game was scripted in a way. Like there was no way of winning this. I don't know how to say, but I felt like this game was we were meant to lose that game. And I don't think the game is like probably scripted. I don't know. I'm t I'm fucking skies or whatever. But anyways, that's the last game I reported him. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'm done for the day. If you got this far, thanks for watching. And yeah, have a good one. Peace out. Peace.